Daytime baseball here on MLB Network. We have season series Diamond Dynasty baseball in this one between the elite and the All Stars. First pitch of a great pitcher's duel is coming up next. And that swung on and fouled straight back. The wind up and the 0 1. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will wind up being a foul ball. Into the wind up. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Got him swinging in the dirt. Perez recovers and he makes the throw to first. Aparicio. Is retired and there's one away. Now at the plate, Sean Green. He'll get to take his first cuts here. First pitch on its way. Looks at a two seamer right down the middle. Our temperature hot but not overly hot. 87 degrees here at first pitch. And then that's a pretty good example of why he's such a great pitcher. Yeah, stuff. Stuff is obviously the important key to being dominant on the mound, but it doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't have outstanding control to go along with it. But he does, and he really spotted that pitch. Throw to first will take care of him. Got Score it two to three on the put out, and there are two gone Charlie now. Blackman. Charlie Blackman stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. Oh man, he's got a chance to strike out the side on nine pitches. Seven down, two to go. The knee buckler and he swings and misses at it. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. Perez corrals it. The throw to first is in time and the inning is over. Here's Elvis Andrus now. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Huntsville. And now a swing and a miss, and that's what you call establishing the inside part of the plate. It's strike one. And a liner foul into the seats down the right side. And he got him. Here's your one to Cespedes. He's set. Here it comes. First pitch has him dancing to avoid it. It's ball one. That was a changeup, so there really wasn't any intent behind it. Looked to me like it just slipped out of his hand a little bit. That'll happen sometimes because of the grip of that straight changeup. Outside, two and one. Oh, he breaks out the hook there. Good for strike two. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? I think one of the keys, Matt, you want to try to initiate contact. The one thing you don't want to do, you don't want to run the count to three balls and two strikes. Whatever you want to throw, throw it over for a strike. First baseman, Jose. Liner Abreu. towards second. But this is hauled in by the second baseman. Throw won't get him. Here's Nelson Batting Cruz forward. now. He takes Left his first fielding. cuts in this one with a Nelson man at first and two away. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. Here's one fouled off to the right as the count evens at one and one. Oh, had him off stride that time, and it's one and two. Well, that's not a good pitch for him to hit. Look, this fellow's got so much power, but you got to bring the pitch into the zone. Chasing that one there right there, I'd go back and throw it to him again. And he's safe at first, so a costly mistake on the drop third strike as now the inning will continue. Right fielder. Here comes the first Aaron. pitch. Aaron Judge stands in as he can't connect here. 0 and 1. 0 1 pitch on its way. A swing and a miss at one that almost hit him. Buckholtz sets. Here's the 0 2. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Zanino gathers it. And the throw to first ends the inning. 
Anthony Rizzo stands in now. Leading He'll off lead it off Republic. against Jake Arrieta. First baseman, Anthony Rizzo. And he starts him out with a strike on the outer half. Here's the 0 1 pitch. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Rizzo will head for second. Around second now and headed for third. The relay throw. And he will make it back to second and be content with holding on there. Coming to the plate now, Nelson Cruz. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. The 1-0 one oh delivery. Downstairs, two balls and no strikes. Tough situation for him right here. I mean, he's got an open base, so he doesn't have to get into this guy. But there's definitely danger looming on deck, so you can't just completely work around him either. In the dirt here, throw goes over to third, and he is safe at third as he moves up on what's likely to be ruled a wild pitch. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. And he chased it in the dirt. Perez recovers. Perez reaches out and tags him to make it official. And there's one away. There's Robbie Cano now. First swings for him in this one with the runner still at first and one gone. And this one gets away. And he is safe at second base as the decision to move up pays off. And that'll likely be scored a wild pitch. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Andres to his left. He's there. Throw to first, and Cano's a ground out victim. Two gone. But no, he'll put on the brakes and head back to third. So a man at third here with two gone. And set to stand in. A guy who seems to get better with age. The dangerous Adrian Beltre. A swinging bunt to the mound. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Stepping into the box, Dustin Pedroia. He'll start things out here in a tie Second ball game. Baseman. Now a little pop-up off toward the first base side. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. And he's retired one away. Digging in, Anthony Rendon, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. And this pitch just about saws him off as he can't get extended at all. It's strike one. And this is fouled back and out of play. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Batting eight. From the stretch. A swing and a miss at a ball down. That's exactly what you don't want to do first pitch. If you're going to swing first pitch, you want to drive it. You can't take an ugly, bad swing on the first pitch when you know what you're looking for. Threw it right past him. A swing and a miss at the gas. And Stepping in, Mike Zanino. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. Mike Zanino. And this is cut on and missed below the knees, and it's 0-1. Uh, tried to pull that one back, but he couldn't do it, and it's 0-2 now. Now here's the pitch. And this is swung on and missed. Five quick strikeouts now, and that's your first out of the inning. the pitcher, number 11. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Clay Buckholz comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Big tilt on the slider gets his swing and a miss. Well, he doubled up on that slider, so that tells me he's really feeling it at this point in the game. Good chance we'll see a heavy dose of that slider as this start continues. So he got him swinging. Clay Buckholz is at number two here in the third inning. And now the infield shifts into a bunt prevent formation. No surprise with the speed that's at the plate. And he gets a piece of it here, but it's chopped foul. The wind up and the 0 1. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Into the wind up. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. 
tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's one and two. Wow, that's a tough pitch to lay off right there. You're down 0-2. You're in protect mode. You want to chase that ball. Nice layoff. He'll try again, 1-2. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball. At the plate, Jake Arrieta. He'll get us going in the home half of inning number three. Drops one down here, and he'll try to beat it out. But the throw will beat him at first, so the bunt for hit attempt is snuffed out. Riding in once again, Elvis Andrews. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Runs up and gets this one down. On to first, and very quickly, two are gone here in the home third. The center fielder number. Digging 52. in to try it again. Joanna Cespedes. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Oh, and he'll try to take control of the inside part of the plate with the fastball as he backs him off a bit. Oh, and this one has hit a ton out to center. Racing back the center fielder. Cespedes will turn for second. And he'll coast into second here with a two out double. So here's the slugging first, first baseman, baseman Jose Abreu now. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Two is left. Rizzo. And he is out on the tag. Ready for another chance. Sean Green. He's over for one thus far. Left fielder. Sean he tried to Green. golf at it, but he missed strike one. Still all zeros in the run column here in the fourth inning. Dan, does this continue, or does somebody score here? I think this continues for a while, Matt. Both of these pitchers are throwing very well, throwing strikes, having good command of their off-speed pitches. This is going to be one of those low-scoring affairs. One and two, here it comes. And the changeup is way low that time. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. And he struck him out. Strikeout number eight now in the ballgame for him. Here's Charlie Blackman now. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. And that's cut on and missed 0 and 1. Slice down the left side, but foul. Wow, he's cruising right now out there. Four straight punch outs and working on number five. That's inside and low. It's a ball and two strikes. Tried to get him to chase that 0 2 curveball there, but he wasn't biting. Very well could see it again here, though. And this is strike three call. Make it five straight punch outs. Two away now. Anthony Rizzo. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. And he gets him to swing through that one. He's in control 0 and 2. Looking for his 10th strikeout. Here's the pitch. One ball, two strikes. Might have been looking to find that outside corner, but he couldn't quite get it there. It's 1 and 2. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at 2 and 2. And the pitch. And my goodness, how about this? He struck out the side. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Nelson Leading Cruz. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Buck holds right back to work as this is swung on and missed for the first strike. Pitch on the way. Oh, it has him looking silly here. It's 0 2. Not much to say about that swing other than it should have never happened. Hit hard on the ground a second. Cano has it. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Here's big Aaron Judge looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. And this one's not close. It's in the dirt for ball one. Now here's the pitch. Inside here with the cutter as he's lucky that one didn't get him. Well, not a great spot to be in right now. 2 and 0 to a great hitter like this. This is when you really have to pay attention as a pitcher. And if you have good off speed stuff, this might be the time to start mixing in your off speed stuff. Uh, could have been three and one. Instead, it's two and two. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. The second baseman Here's the second baseman now, Dustin Pedroia. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Green waits on it. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. 
Digging in for his second at bat. Nelson Cruz will start things out as we begin the fifth. Right fielder. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Swing and a line drive. But a foul ball. Wind up and the 0 1. And I believe they'll say he broke the plane as yes, he did. It's ruled a strike. Trying to send him packing for the second time. And he's going to start this inning out the same way he started the previous two. Seven consecutive strikeouts. My word. One away. Robinson Cano will stand in for the second time now as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. I like that curveball right there. You know he's sitting one fastball. Ball, he wants to ambush one, jump it right out of the yard, and you drop the curveball on him. Got an 0 1 count. And he misses two and one. Just one hit apiece for both of these clubs. Oh, and this one has hit a ton out to center racing back the center fielder and that'll get down out there near the wall not in time and he's in there with a double here's the third baseman Adrian Belfry he's over one thus far and this one gets away the throw will go to third and he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch 1 and 0 pitch on the way. Good change up that time, but he wouldn't bite on it. Hey, that's not some bad pitching right there. You're two pitches down, but you have a runner on third, and you know this hitter is looking for something up in the zone that he can hit into the air for a sacrifice fly. Line to the right side. Judge is there. Let's see if they test it. But no, he'll put on the brakes and head back to third. Here now is Mike Zanino. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Chopped weakly to the left. Rendon is there. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Now to the plate. Anthony Rendon. 0 for 1 for him. Cairo Irving is going to take over here in inning number 5. So it'll be a bullpen game from here on out. And he'll try to take control of the inside part of the plate here as that misses. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. Here's a swing and a ground ball, but a foul ball. 1 and 1. Well, he's out in front of that breaking ball right there. Not surprised. That was after that fastball. Nice job of pitching, kind of keeping him off balance. Now here it comes. In there, and it's even now, two and two. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. Now a little pop up off toward the first base side, and this is going to wind up a foul ball. And he takes strike three cold on the fastball, one gone. Stepping up to the plate, Salvador Perez. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Green racing back off the LED board and gone. In now, Jake Arrieta, Tommy Kingley. A six foot one inch right hander will be the one to get the call from the bullpen here. Committed to that one a bit too soon as it locks him up for strike one. Oh, he had him fooled there. No balls and two strikes. Here it comes on nothing and two. And he's bunting here with two strikes, but he misses, and that's a rather weak out number two. Ball hit out towards Cano at second. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Now at the plate, Tommy Kainley is getting his Leading first plate appearance of the game here in the sixth. Yes, Tommy Kainley. And now the manager brings his outfield in here with the pitcher at the plate. Doesn't want to get burned on any weak bloopers. 
sinker to open the AB in there for strike one. Now the outfield signal to play shallow. We'll see if that works out. Just lucky to make contact on that one as it's chopped foul. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Scoring with two strikes as he gets this one down. And good hustle to get over and tag him for the out. Digging now in batting. once again, Louis Aparicio. Louis he struck Aparicio. out twice thus far, so we'll see if he can fare any better here. And now the infield shifts into a bunt prevent formation. No surprise with the speed that's at the plate. Swung on and missed that time. It's 0-1. Well, that is a good pitch. A sinker down with that kind of movement, it is really hard to hit. No wonder he swung and missed. Swing and a little blooper to center. Cespedes comes on now and makes the catch in shallow center for round number two. Riding in once again, Sean Green. Been a strikeout victim twice in this one. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Now the big overhand curveball makes him swing and miss. One thing you try to do as a hitter is figure out what pattern the pitcher is pitching. I can't cover the whole plate. He's done a masterful job of pounding them on the outside half for strikes, and they haven't figured it out yet. From the windup, the 1-1 pitch. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. There to get it is Pedroia. He'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the Here's Juana Cespedes. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. First pitch on its way. Now a flare out toward right center. Cano ranging into the outfield, and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. The first baseman, number so here's the slugging first baseman Jose Abreu now. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Hard hit ball to second. And he'll whip this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. The left fielder, number here's Nelson Cruz now. Nelson he comes in Cruz. 0 for 2 thus far. Sends that one out of play for strike one. The 0 1 pitch. Got a big pass at a slider that gets past him. So back to back sliders for strikes. Does he come back with yet? There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no doubt home run. Ready once again. Right hander starts to loosen out from the bullpen now. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. A 1 0 delivery. Scorch to third. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Here's Charlie Blackman now. He'll be tasked with starting things as we begin the seventh. Charlie. And now a swing and a miss, and that's what you call establishing the inside part of the plate. It's strike one. I've been so impressed how he's got ahead of hitters. He's been over 80% in the game right now. First pitch strike to hitters. When you do that, you're going to have good success. Nope. A fastball that just misses inside. Ready to deliver the one and two. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. One for two with a double on his line thus far. Swing and a miss on a pitch below the knees. One strike. He's been doing a nice job out there on the mound, but the deeper you get into the game, the more the hitters have seen you. This is the part of the lineup that he has to be really careful with. Around first, he's digging for second. And he'll pull in there with a one-out double. Digging in to try it again. Nelson Cruz. He's hoping to avoid the hat trick. He struck out in each of his first two plate appearances so far. And he gets a piece of this one to foul it toward the backstop. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Played on the backhand. In time to first, and there are two away. 
Digging in and looking for more. Robinson Cano. He doubled earlier in the game. One for two to this point. And he'll take first here on the intentional walk. So make it runners at the corners now with two away. From the belt, the pitch. And a breaking ball that's chopped foul at the plate. It's 0-1. Now a throw over, and he has to dive, but he's back in easily. The 0-1. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Here's the one and one now to Beltre. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. With runners on base, two outs and two strikes, this is a big next hit. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Dustin Pedroia. Off no the hits in two trips to the Second plate for him run. in the ball game. Dustin Pedroia. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And a neck-high fastball that time. 1-0 home to Pedroia. Fooled pretty badly there as he reaches to poke this one foul. Well, he fouled that breaking ball off a little bit early. Timing not quite there. Had a fastball to pitch before. He just got out in front of that breaking ball. Not too often you see a changeup come across at 88 miles an hour on the gun. Still effective when you're throwing a fastball in the high 90s, though. In now is Anthony Rendon. Anthony and he's likely just Rendon. trying to put one in play here. 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts thus far. One out, nobody on. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one. And a changeup runs in on him, and he's got a duck out of the way. He's set, and the 2 1 pitch. A swing and a miss at a ball down. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Now a fastball runs inside and drills him. Oh, that's got to hurt. Ready for another chance? Salvador Perez. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. And he swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. Hit the target, but this is low. Two and one. The set and the two and one pitch. Started to chase that time, but then he wisely holds off for ball three. And he lays off here. A nice job. It's ball four. First and second now with. The pitcher, number 49, Jake. Corey Dickerson will get the call to pinch hit here, and they'll find he has a couple of runners aboard with only one out in the inning. Goes to third with it, and he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. Comes set with the 0 and 1. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Here he is in his third inning of work out of the pen, which isn't all that common these days. A lot of times you see guys get too aggressive and try to do too much at the plate with guys on, but right Right here, he's doing a great job of waiting on the right. Now pitching. Tyler Clipper Tyler takes the Clipper. call from the pen as he'll try to get the final two outs of this seventh frame. Well, you got two runners on scoring position, one out. Good thing, you got the pitcher at the plate. You got to attack him just like a normal hitter. You can't give in right now. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. That's back toward the mound. This will be a tough turn, however. The tag, and he's out at the plate. Riding into the box, Joanna Cespedes. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. And this is going to be a foul ball. Ready with the 0-1. Way in front of that fastball. He put himself in a good position, jumping ahead 0-2 with the bases loaded. Now we'll see if he can finish it off. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. And now everybody's running. And he strikes him out, so a missed Juan Nicasio has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Ready for another shot now. Mike Zanino. He'll start things out for us here in inning number eight. First pitch of the inning is taken downstairs for a ball. It's 1-0. That's inside. 2-0. 
2 and 0 count. Here it comes. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. Boy, what a time to pull the string on him. On 2 0, there's no way anyone's thinking changeup. So if you can locate it, that's pretty much unhittable. That was a good pitch right there. Started at the knees, got the hard sink down, got him to swing right through it. Beautiful. Softly hit to short. A barehand play by Andrus in time. Digging in. Tyler Clipper, and he's getting his first Aaron Judge will move into the on-deck circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. Swing and a little tapper. Throw is not going to be in time to get him, and somehow he's going to wind up with an in. Field single, D. Gordon. Louis Aparicio. He's set and the pitch and a pitch out nothing doing though and that's ball one but he's safe at first as he gets back in time the one and no delivery a favorable call in there for a strike this is the situation where there's a lot of pressure on the infielders if the balls put in play on the ground both the guy at first and at the plate are burners so a double play is going to be tough even getting one out could be a challenge thought about going for second but instead now they've got him in a pickle. A tag, and he is out on a questionable decision to tag up. It's a Your Phil Hughes is on to pitch out. Now, pitching. now with the plate, Hughes. Jose Abreu. He'll have a new pitcher waiting for him as we begin their half of the eighth. Bounce towards the mound. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. 